Hi there, ladies and gents. I'm Biff, your trusty arms commentator. I'm usually pretty quiet, but I'm always game to talk about the arms game. The one with the weaponized extendable arms. So let's get into it. Now stay tuned and always stay in arm's reach. Sorry, couldn't resist. Yep, you guessed it. The biggest feature is the weaponry fighters attached to their fists, called arms. There are standard glove type arms, multi-shot arms that really cause a ruckus, specialized curving arms for cornering opponents, and powerful heavyweight class arms, just to name a few. Each arm has a special attribute that activates when charged up. Light up your opponent to knock him down with fire. Stun and electrify your rival with lightning. Blow away the competition with a tornado of wind. And freeze your foe to slow him down with ice. You get the point. You want more, right? Perfectly normal. Try the Get Arms service, courtesy of the Arms League. The in-game currency you earn can be used for a chance to unlock new arms. The more you fight, the more arms you have in your arsenal. There's a veritable treasure trove of arms on offer, and the fighters who use them are pretty tricky themselves. The comeback king of spring, the rocket girl who never flinches, the elusive ninja, one tough mummy, and my idol, Ribbon Girl. Their unique traits are as distinguished as the fighters themselves. Not to mention, each one can mix and match any two available arms. That's right, fighting fans. The game gets deeper and deeper as players discover new combinations of fighters and arms. Now, get a load of this. Today, I'll give you a peek into how deep the strategy can get and how much it depends on your own approach to arming and using a fighter in an actual match. Now, it's time to get amped up as I introduce to you a new contender, the Ramen Bomber, Ramen. Min Min. Min Min is one spicy noodle-wielding fighter. When she dodges in the air, she can also kick down enemy attacks. Wait, you didn't think punches are the only attacks in arms, did you? That's one big misconception. Min Min is living proof of that. She can throw her opponent, and her left arm can transform into a dragon. This augmented arm can maintain a longer charge, so beat the sauce out of your rivals. Anyone getting hungry? I wish my arms were made of noodles. Sorry, I lost myself there for a sec. <clears throat> Next up is the enthusiastic Spring Man. After charging up, release to initiate a shockwave that can repel attacks with his overflowing energy and determination. His famous forte involves deflecting his opponent's punches, then delivering powerful counterattacks. When his health drops below 25%, his never-say-die attitude kicks in, and his punches will stay perma-charged. His slick-back spring hair isn't just for show. He actually gets stronger after bouncing back from a desperate situation. You know, I feel a fight coming. Guess I'll serve as your commentator. Let's see, Min Min has a fiery Ram Ram on the right and a fiery dragon on the left. She must have a hot temper. Spring Man has a fiery Slap Amanda on the right and an icy Chilla on the left. Huh, not sure where he's going with that. Well, let's take up arms. Okay, here's Min Min right away. She's charging up and there's her dragon arm. With her dragon arm and that dragon arm, it really looks like a real dragon. The dragon roasts opponents with a high-powered laser. There's a bit of delay before it fires, but its power is exceptional. She's got Springman cornered with her combo attacks, and a left, and a right, and a... Wait! Springman's counterattack has kicked in after deflecting a shockwave. Her dragon arm has no choice but to return to old ramen noodles. Both fighters continue to pummel each other. Ouch! He lands a right while dodging the laser. Min Min won't last if this keeps up. 
Carefully timing the gaps between punches is an important technique. Wow, she's dishing out quick hits like she's cutting noodles. You'll notice Min Min carefully arcing her punches with her Ram Ram. She must be trying to rack up small hits over time. Boy, it's getting heated on the edge of the ramen bowl. Oh, again with the dragon arm. Her left arm is really charged up. Their assaults continue while they expertly dodge incoming attacks. And here comes the finisher. Wait, no! Instead, she avoids the counterattack with the guard. Talk about clarity under pressure, but just how much damage can her right arm take? Oh no, her right arm is down. She's completely open to attack until she can. Yes, she manages to recover. Her kick is smacking down his arms and now a simultaneous punch. Both fighters are desperately trying to recover their footing. Bam! He took that powered up dragon and it's not looking good. Springman's last hope is his special comeback. He'll never give up. Min Min has to finish this match before it's too late. Can she seal the deal? Yes, she did, thanks to her dragon's laser. Min Min steals the win. So how'd that strike you? From the fighters to their arms and abilities, there's an arsenal of techniques to unleash, and the rivalry is heating up. Now that is arms. And when I say rivalry, I'm not just talking about one-on-one -on -one matches. Sometimes you just gotta shake things up with some two-on-two -two action. We got a lot more hiding up our long sleeves, so please stay tuned. Stretch the limits of your fighting skills when ARMS launches June 16th. Until next time, fighting fans.